Hi, and welcome back to Bear Food Kitchen. If you... That's okay, we forget our lines. All right, let's do it again. Three, two, okay, we'll do it again. No. Um, can we get baby to quiet, please? All right. Um, naturally release. No, we didn't. We didn't do that. See, we didn't do that. And welcome back to Bear Food Kitchen. My name is Tina Bear, and if you are new to our channel, hit the subscribe button. Today we are making a yummy artichoke with jackfruit dip. Kind of like the restaurant artichoke dip, but this one is even better with the jackfruit. So the first thing we're going to do is we are going to cut up some artichoke bottoms. So these are the hearts of the artichoke. And you want them in fairly thin slices. They will break down a little bit more. Of course, you know everybody wants that big piece of artichoke. That's what they go for. So we're just going to go ahead and start pouring it in. First thing we have, oh, my drink. Almost knocked it over. We have some chicken broth. And we have some garlic. Ton of garlic. We have some powdered onion. And I like the dried minced onion. It just adds to whatever I'm cooking. So I use it all the time. We are gonna use some mayo. Get it all in there. Hello. And we're going to add some sour cream. Just like that. Give that a little zhuzh. Can't wait to. Then, of course. We have one block, eight ounces of frozen spinach. You're just gonna lay that in. Yes, it's frozen, you don't have to thaw it. We're gonna add the cream cheese in. And then I chopped up some jackfruit. If you haven't ever tried jackfruit, I recommend it. A lot of, um, if you're vegan, you know what it is. You could turn it into pulled pork or make a stew out of it. It tastes similar to artichokes. They're delicious. I'm serious. And we are just going to pour this on top and we're not going to stir it. So everything on top, just like that. And then I'm going to chop up the mozzarella into cubes, put the Parmesan cheese in after it's done cooking. So we'll put the lid on. Turn the valve to seal, the pressure valve. You're going to set it for four minutes on high pressure. Okay, you guys, we are back. We quick released the artichoke and the jackfruit and we're going to give it a little stir. Oh, that looks amazing. So in here we're going to go ahead and just cube up some mozzarella. You could use the shredded mozzarella if you like. I like the um, block of mozzarella, just cube it up. It melts right away because it's super hot. It smells so good. And then I have a sourdough loaf. I'm gonna hollow it out and then we're gonna serve the dip inside there. We also have some chips, so it goes so well with everything. Even your leftovers, if you want to use your leftovers for pasta, just heat some pasta up 
throw it in there. So good. And then we have some Parmesan. It's about a cup and a half. You have to have the Parmesan in here. It's what makes the dip besides the artichokes and the jackfruit. Stir it up just like that. Now, I don't have it on saute because it is warm. Pretty darn hot and everything melts pretty fast. So I'm just going to leave it like that because I don't want it to burn. I'm going to let it set for a second while I hollow out this loaf of beautiful, you hear that? It's solid. It's a solid loaf. So we're just going to cut the top off, big or small. Just depends how much you want to eat. Just like that. And then I like to kind of cut around the edges before I dig in there. Take out the center. And this is what we'll use to dip for the bread. And I like to just kind of scoop it out. Like that. And the best part is the bottom where all the flavors soak in. So delicious. It's amazing. Look at that. It's a beautiful loaf. These will cut up, set them around the side. Everyone will be munching on those. Let me see how this cheese is. Oh, yeah. Ooey gooey delicious. Okay, I'm gonna put this on the plate so I don't spill. I'm gonna serve this up. Oh my gosh, look how cheesy. So cheesy. I might have to pour it. I'm gonna have to pour it. Let me just get this because it's so hot. Maybe I'll get an assistant over here. See how cheesy? All right. Oh, well, thank you. Do you mind just pouring some of that into that bowl? Woo, woo. Oh my gosh, it's so cheesy. I don't know what to You got scissors? Okay. Is that delicious? That looks amazing. It's amazing. It's so amazing. I'm going to give it a little taste. Let me cut a piece of this bread. Just a little spoon. And I could smell the spinach, the artichoke. Oh. It's so cheesy good. I could sit there with a spoon or a fork and eat this whole bread bowl. Uh, no, look how cheesy that is. Have you ever seen anything as cheesy as that? Look at that. Does that look delicious? I'll go ahead and cut that off. Mm. So good. Let me know what you think. Comment, like, subscribe. I'd love to hear from you. Be kind to each other. Enjoy your food.